Hi Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. Welcome to my channel, Advice to Think Twice. My name is Monica, and I'm here with a mid-monthly reading for you, um, looking at what the second half of August has in store for you. So as always, keep in mind, these are general, so they're not going to apply to everyone or not in the same way. Watch your Sun, your Moon, and your Rising Sign readings for additional messages that may apply to you. If you're interested in a, pl a private reading, sorry, the link is below. And if you'd like to join me on Patreon, the link is also below. And thank you to my patrons. So let's have a look at what the rest of August has in store for you here. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Hangman as the overall energy. So with the Hangman here, this is, I feel, what you're coming from. I feel for some, this is what you've been dealing with. So a time of stagnation for some, waiting, as well as perhaps more study rather than action, more research rather than action, more, you know, reading, applying, uh, putting together presentations, maybe uh, going on interviews, and then not a lot happening from that, but it was more talk or research or study rather than action. And it's very early in the morning, and actually my voice isn't warmed up, so just bear with me there, okay? So the cards that we have for you, we have the Three of Pentacles, the Three of Cups, and the Justice card. So with this, I feel that you definitely have a celebration coming in, absolutely. It could be around the news that you are getting a new job, okay, we have the Justice card, there's a contract there. Um, for others, this is you got the promotion, you had to study, you had to train, you had to, you know, put together files, folders, presentations, meet people, whatever, so that actually took you away from working, actually working, um, but it's paying off for you because there is there is good news about growth, promotion, more money, um, even study programs, getting into that training program. There's a lot of documentation, there's a lot of paperwork. For others, this is about just paperwork, okay? So whatever it is that you've been putting together, files, folders, presentations, I'm getting again, interviews, whether this is about residency or um, anything else you might be requesting, maybe in a legal setting as well in terms of courts, you know, um, maybe you had to take time off to go to court, um, it's coming through, it's moving forward, you get the decision, you get the settlement, um, you get the final decision, you won't have to deal with this ever again. Um, but it is a time of growth with, with two threes here. Threes are all about expansion, new horizons. So for some, this is over moving. You get to move, okay? Maybe you were in limbo, not sure what was happening, not sure what was going to come through. Um, but now you get the news about the money, you got the mortgage, you got the loan. Um, you get you get the grant or the financial backing if this is for your own business or a project you're trying to get off the ground. This is also joining a new community, a new group of people. So that could be new people that you're going to be working with. Um, a new group of friends, maybe you're taking on a new hobby that you can turn into a business. Or you're all there to study the same thing. So it's like-minded people, even though maybe you have separate plans for what you do after that study or course or training program whatever that is for you um there is there is a decision or a contract that's coming through that is final it's something you've been waiting for and it's finally coming through okay so for the rest of august it looks like there's growth it looks like there is new um contracts paperwork um moving is possible new jobs new friends, okay, um, and you never know, maybe you're going to meet someone new where you are now starting to work, or you're making a new group of, of friends, joining a new group of people, and there's someone there who might spark your romantic interest as well, okay, you don't know, but whatever it is, it's meant to happen the way it's, it's happening with the hangman and the justice card. Um, if you, this is something that you're doing now, okay, if you're now preparing for something, with the three of pentacles, I would say, Pay close attention to the details. Try not to, you know, embellish or flourish or whatever um, in terms of wording or whatever, especially if it's about numbers or about a goal or about a business plan. Stick to the cold facts, the numbers. Um, it will come through, okay? Your passion, your dedication, your high hopes for the project, it will come through um, in how you express yourself. So just be natural with that, okay? 
Um, and if you have any presentations, these will go well. Again, focus on the facts. Relax, be yourself, okay? Remember to smile and make eye contact with people. Um, and it's, go, it's going to go over very well. Let's look at your advice card. So we have Tanzanite for you. Maybe you could work with uh, Tanzanite, okay, for the rest of August. Um, we have Ready to Love Again. You've healed from the past enough to open your heart to new love. So for some, this is about a, a divorce that I learned that it's finally coming through. It was a difficult breakup. It was a difficult situation. It was messy. It was complicated. It's finally coming through. You get to celebrate. And actually, you're ready for love again. You find yourself happy and ho hopeful again when it comes to love. Or you actually meet a new person during this time. And for others, this is saying you've been healing, you've been recovering, you've make, made a lot of progress, and now you're ready to get yourself back out again, okay, with that, if this is about love. Um, but this is also financial healing, as it's coming through for some, or healing in terms of your career, getting back on track, especially if it's something you love to do. It's getting back on track, it's being uh, on track, it's being healed um, during this time you're about to see growth and progress okay but you are at the beginning of something with this energy that you've been hoping for wishing for working for um and it will bring you great joy and happiness okay is is what i'm getting here so aries that is your reading for the rest of august i hope it makes sense and i hope it helps let me know okay comment down below let me know what you think let me know how the cards apply to you if they do remember to watch your sun your moon and your rising sign. You can watch this if you're dealing with the Aries as well. Have a fantastic rest of August, and I'll see you again very, very soon. Bye for now.